Hi, Fox Rental Farm. Uh, we are a 3D production company based between Milan and Paris. But nowadays, let's say that we are becoming more and more like a cloud company because we are starting to have collaborators all over the world. Last time we had an interview, uh, we were still rooted into architectural visualization world. That's actually where our history started. Uh, but we also were in a peculiar moment when we were starting to dipping our toes into other industries like uh, uh, today we have a, a lot of ongoing projects related to different businesses from art to design, from fashion to cinema and we also had the chance to, to grow a lot during the pandemic uh, as we could guarantee to our clients a structured remote team able to perform and work from anywhere in the globe. So that was our uh, key of the success in the last few years. Per the idea uh, that really revolutionized our work uh, and our workflow mainly uh, together with our pipeline was to take inspiration from a big cinema production. Meaning that now we tend to divide and split as much as possible in small segment um, every specific function of a, of a project. So basically modeling, texturing, lighting, shading, post-production, IT uh, support, but also client management. Uh, those are separate tasks done by specific teams uh, made of people mainly uh, and mostly um, that really love to do what they do. So in that, in that way we can guarantee that people working in specific team really love their everyday job. Yeah, uh, Equilibrium is a full CGI video. Everything was created in 3D, and uh, but uh, not the, 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 the good way to achieve realism uh, is emotion. Uh, it's, uh, every, it's something that every CG artist needs to understand. Uh, once we achieve the look and we achieve the uh, the emotions, everything is done. Realism doesn't come with texture, doesn't come with good models but with the feeling and the, the mood of the story and what's behind them. Uh, Equilibrium um, had a, a deep thinking behind the curtains, uh, we, we, but we went a lot in simplicity. Uh, there are a lot of scenes that are extremely simple in, in terms of CG work. Just a couple of animated planes, uh, uh, animate, like made in 2D compositing, uh, so it's animated later, but they were super effective to the message that we wanted to convey. Uh, yes, water, water is an important feature of our studio. Uh, we are constantly working and uh, trying to understand how to better integrate the water in our scenes. In Tempo d'Aqua there are some scenes that took over a year to simulate, uh, for example, and they never emerged in the video. And I guess and I hope one day we will publish them, but uh, it's a long process uh, and it's all about simulation. Um, I think water simulation are uh, the ones that require the most time to spend on it because uh, when it comes to water simulation we, we tend to use Houdini but sometimes the, the tool that we use um, uh, needs to be custom made because we, we are looking for a specific look and so if we want to achieve this specific look uh, it takes a lot of time of iteration and uh, approaching the, the, the problem in different ways. So this is something that uh, we, we try to, to keep the exploration uh, of multiple iterations of the same process and uh, uh, this, this, this allows us to, to, to not have to tweak different parts that could influence the, the extremely the, the simulation itself because it's really time dependent. Um, the secret behind the look of the leaves is, is making uh, a very high focal length. It's pretty simple. Uh, it, it's like we are shooting a macro photo. Uh, this will allow us to have this wonderful dynamic bouquet of the reflections. And also in that specific shot we wanted to, to reach the, uh, the anamorphic lens effect. And, uh, and that's it. And for the snake itself it's even simpler in my opinion because it's a sweep object it's a sweep object which rotates in different directions and uh, that is helping uh, the, the, the idea of moving and uh, there is also the, the displacement texture that goes over it and it's animated to move uh, and this um, helps us a little bit more to achieve this look of a living being 
another important thing that I want to, to, to express is the, the metal reflection. The metal reflection gives us an important field light on those shots, uh, helping us to uh, bring the attention on the shapes and the smoothness and everything that is all around. Understanding the light is uh, the key of, of, of success of the shot to me. Uh, but in still in motion, the camera position or its movement uh, and lighting together, those are em elements that cannot be treated separately. Those are subsequent in some ways. Because I think light shapes uh, the geometry and the elements and can be mysterious or revealing at the same time. And uh, this happens just changing a small, small parameter. If you always tackle them as a duo, you can easily create amazing shots and have basically the power to showcase every single subject in its best version. Amazing. What else we can do about it? You guys rock. Uh, I don't even understand what's the secret behind this super being so kind at 3 a.m. when we write you on Skype, panicking for support. This is crazy. This is super great. But no jokes apart, um, we couldn't be able to be so on time and productive without Fox Render Fund. You are almost part of the team now and uh, uh, we are super glad to have this relationship with you guys. Well, do, do not spend too much time on social media. In any case, uh, you, you can use them, of course. Use them for sharing kitties, uh, sharing photos of your barbecue, a video of the ugly better your haunt gave you for Christmas, but please do not get in the loop of producing art uh, just to follow an algorithm. Uh, you, you should be driven by passion, do what you like, uh, when you like, of course. Uh, if it's a personal work, spend all the time you want on it, uh, show to your friends, show to people who can really give you an honest and uh, uh, constructive feedback on it, an honest opinion. Uh, and if it's commercial, push yourself and your client beyond the limits, try to reach the best. And before the deadline hits, do whatever you can. And I guess in that specific case, Fox Render Farm can help you a lot. Of